Hi everyone, John Martinson here, founder of RoboLinux. You can call me Robo. Everyone else has been since 2011. It is sad, but I've run out of time trying to get a remote job. Um, tried for three months. Trying to save my family of five. And um, if I don't get a job or some help immediately before March 1st, then the RoboLinux servers will go down, and my family and I are going to go ahead and starve to death in the streets of Phnom Penh, Cambodia. This is reality, unfortunately. If you do care and want to help RoboLinux and my family stay alive, please make a donation on our GoFundMe campaign webpage, which you can find on the RoboLinux contact, install, and FAQ webpages here. All you got to do is click the picture um, and it'll take you over to GoFundMe and if you can spare a dollar or whatever, you know, anything you can help will allow us to stay alive at least for as long as people help us. So what's this new 10.9 version all about? Um, Many Windows 7 users simply do not want to or cannot afford to upgrade to Windows 10. But that's not a problem because the RoboLinux 10.8 versions offer the user a downloadable, optimal, one-click, fully built Windows 7 or a 10, if you desire that image, which Stealth VM converts instantly on the fly, only requiring the user to enter their keys if you want to. I ran out of my keys, so I don't care. Um, this is a sa this is saving a lot of time for those who users who are too busy or cannot handle the complexity of cloning their existing Windows partitions with our RoboLinux C drive to VM cloning tool. And of course, if you're running an OEM version of Windows, who knows if it'll work? Some do, some don't. With this RoboLinux 10.9 version. Um, it has, it's been really optimized. It was my best work I could do. It's rock solid. We have the Cinnamon Mate 3D XFCE operating systems. They all have a new kernel. Um, many of the newest, a lot of the newest hardware drivers, plus over 150 security and application updates. All current RoboLinux 10.8 users can upgrade to version 10.9 in just one click by using the built-in RoboLinux Auto Upgrade button in the main menu like this. It's really easy. Go to Administration, go and click here, Auto Upgrade RoboLinux. Thank you for watching this RoboLinux video. It's probably my last, so I'll go ahead and say goodbye. I hope you have a wonderful day, and may Yahweh bless you and yours.